What is coming after the update? Yeah, another update. Well, that is kind of familiar with some big name, you know. After the update, we get another update. <laughs> This time, new is they just do that. But at least at here, we get some reward. And now, I, oh, to be honest, it is my first time to back login because, well, you know, when I want to jump to the game after the update. At one moment or one second, I get in. They already do another maintenance. So yeah, it is it is my first time to seeing all this thing right here. Okay, first let's see. Yeah, that is the reward. That is the reward. Just look at that. We get a lot, and that is good. That is good. That is fine by me. Well, I hope they always do that. You know, after the update, we get. A premium currency now let's check the first package right here we get a lot yeah something new right here I believe oh that character I I really want to get them okay because right now we have a new character right so let's get started good morning after the evening and night welcome back again with me yoga playing this game brown dust Over here, we see a lot of changes on the UI. Well, actually, it is about the replacement. Yeah, this time we are looking like this when we go to home, and that is look interesting. Actually, can we change it? Yeah, we can. So it based on what character we have, or maybe from the story. Yeah, I believe like that. And this one is for the character. Yeah, so we can change it. But I really never mind about that. Well, actually, I really do love if I can see my favorite character on the main screen over here. And let's go start with a new character. Let's go to the gacha. Look at that. We get a lot of red dots. First, let's talk about the weapon. It is Arc Demons, yeah. You might already seeing this weapon when we do the reroll, you know, because this is one of the basic weapon that we can get as an SR when we do the reroll. But if we if we get this weapon at here at the banner, we will get the UR. And of course, it is the exclusive weapon. So if the character it's not oh look at that we got some a good you are if we if we don't have the character for this weapon well no one cannot can see can wear this yeah that is what i want to say now let's do the free draw first you know before we talking about everything because someone out there Should, should should getting luck by only this one free draw just like me because after this we will talk about that I get I get a, I get a lot of you are rarity on this free single summon every day okay the B rank share yeah this is a new costume for share share is an old character okay I repeat share is is an old character she already are available in this game from the start of our reroll but this time she get another or new costume that we can get by this banner yeah i will do the summon first and let's check her out on the costume there you go we are done and now let's go to the collection to the costume And let's take a look at share. Yes, she already have two costume right now. And what I know, she's really good as a defender or the tanker. Well, even though she's not that really good, but let's say she's a tanker, right? Because that is that is what she do. If we see right here, this is her first costume, right? He will heal 
herself, okay, heal herself when she's using the skill, right? And now that it will decrease the incoming damage over here. It is it is said like that. So that means she's a tanker, right? But without the additional plus plus for her, you know, like a town, like a nullify or like a something like resist or something some some kind of tanker should do on any basic basic game but at here she only care about herself she can do the heal for her and she also can buff only for her so when we have her on our team make sure to put her on the right spot you know what I mean? When we put Sayer, just put them as a tank, where the most powerful enemy attacking. So that is what she for. And now let's see the new costume right here. Okay, the new costume is acquired to SP, and yeah. It is what it say, right? Right. She need to get attack. She need to get attack, right? For two turns to get to free of SP. So that means if she's not getting attack, this two SP right here will not show up. So you need to get attack, and luckily. She also decreased the incoming damage for again it is 40% two turns yeah it is kind of similar with the first costume but it have another effect because the first one that we have on base game it will heal the HP and this time we have this to increase our SP you know that it's that little thing that we need to activate the skill that is the SP right there so because she have this two of combo right if we have the first and the second costume she will doing good as a tanker she will heal herself and she also buffing the SP you get me <laughs> It is easy to understand, right? Yeah, that is what Sayer do. So over here, I get her by the bar, I believe, and I get her for free. Yeah, just record her from the ticket, and I get her first costume. First, I don't need any another flat woman. No, I mean, I don't need any of another woman on my team so yeah what i see right here it is already enough so i don't put her on my team but if you have only her uh, the best character on your team right now well just put her because she's she's actually worth it just make sure you play the game manually if not well who knows we will who will get attacked right because if we play it manually you can put her on the right spot where the biggest hit will get from the enemy of course yeah that is enough that is enough explanation and I hope you understand about that <laughs> and if we also have the weapon for her well can I see it can I see it no no there you go yeah for the weapon it is actually crit react as the first stats right that actually make me more confused she's a tanker but her weapon said she can do the attack because it give the crit rate you get me yeah <laughs> that is what make her not that really good 
as a tanker and now let's compare with the Uno who else that I use actually so I can talk by the experience right Celia over here right she can do the crit rate that is because Celia as a mage or the magic attacker she really hit hard with you know a big size of box that can she hit so it is a good thing if she have a big crit rate but for sale she only do reduce the match right as the skill and buffing the sp and heal herself but for the weapon i don't think so it is buffing the crit rate so if you already have the girl right and you want to get the weapon well i might say skip it you don't need the weapon for her because it will <laughs> make her more not good actually <laughs> Just, just put something with the defense or anything else that you have on your inventory of course just don't put her weapon but if you are just a perfect person right just put it put it put it no one can stop you just put it maybe that little hp percent or the point will helping her on as a tanker yeah sayer be rank idol what did you do? Did you do the summon for her? Or are you just skipping her? Just tell me on the comment below. I'm Yoga signing out.